So guys, I'm still upset with Samsung about the focusing issue on the Galaxy Ultra that I have right here. Um, but anyway, I did the update. I tried it for the day. I played around with it. It's working a bit better, probably about 70%, 80% better, but you still have issues. I trust with taking this device and going down to the park or whatever, or to, to a ball game or to my daughter's show and thinking that this will work 100%, I cannot trust this device. I have no trust for it because you will want to capture something at a certain time and it, it will just blur out. So the fix is not there. So when I put it on, it didn't work perfect and I was then I was really upset. But then I found out that you could hold down, going to, so you could hold the app down, press on it, go into app info, on there and then right on there you see it open up um, the settings of the camera it open up the, the it open up the app information so you're going to tap on storage so you tap on storage just like that and you want to clean your cache right there make sure you clean your cache so it get rid of all the old stuff that's on there that's associated with the old version of the i you know some stuff like that why you have to do this i don't know it, that is what is upsetting about this and this is one way of doing it and then you, you and then you go into your cameras in your camera and you try it and you see if that work if that doesn't work and this is what I had to do and this is what is really annoying why do I have to do this I remember doing this when I used to jailbreak devices and we're too far along in 2020 for me to be doing all this to get my device to work better so even after I cleaned the cache out, it kind of worked a little better, but then that wasn't enough. So I had to go deeper into the device and give it a super duper partition clean. And to do this, you want to put the device off, turn it off completely. And you can see how annoyed I am. I am annoyed. So when it's off, you want to hold the power button and along with the, the volume up rocker together and press and hold. Just like that. And as soon as you see those letters disappear, just let go. So let it go and you're gonna see this just like that. Right here, you want to use your volume, your volume rocker again and bring it on the white cache partition. Just wanna use the volume rocker right there and click down and you're gonna see it's going down until white, ca white cache partition right there and just press the power button it's gonna ask you yes or no again you use the power again you use the the volume rocker go down to yes and then the power button and then it's gonna do its stuff and it's gonna go directly to reboot system and you're gonna reboot your device and your device should reboot and and restart your device and I couldn't believe I was doing all that on my $1,500 device. So you can see I'm still annoyed with all that stuff that I have to do to get my device to run properly. And I went out yesterday and you can see the focusing just wasn't there. Um, normally with my, with my Note 10, which I had with me, taking the same videos, I, I didn't have those kind of issues on there. So that's what was really annoying. And you open your device. So guys, here you have it. Um, after you, you do that, you want to go back into your settings and you want to make sure you put all your stuff in that you normally have the way you set it. Um, you're going to record in 4K and all that kind of stuff. Set your, your camera up and then go from there. And it's, it's like I said, it's a, it's a bit better. Um, it's, it's almost there. Samsung is getting, I guess they're really working to get this going. But I'm just not satisfied that I paid a thousand five hundred dollars for this, and it's been like almost two months, and I'm still doing things like it's almost like I feel like I'm jailbreaking to get my device to run properly. My issue with this is I, I know for most people they wouldn't they wouldn't feel it, but for me I'm feeling it because I have two devices, I have more than one phone in my hand at the, at the same time, and I know that the the, the Samsung Galaxy 10 Plus. Is doing quite a better job than than this is doing, but it's but like I said, it's not bad. The focus is not; it's just not fast enough. 
it's just not um, where it's supposed to be. But this is Charlie, like and subscribe. I'm out.